React Control is an open source administrative console developed by Basho Technologies for managing, monitoring, and interfacing with React clusters. React Control is comprised of three major components, Snapshot, Cluster, and Ring. The Snapshot page presents a general overview of the health of the cluster. It is here in the Snapshot page where problems across the cluster are aggregated and listed in an easy-to-read format. Let's say a node becomes unreachable or experiences low memory. That node will be listed here on the Snapshot page, along with a description of the problem or problems it is experiencing. A red letter X lets you know very quickly that something has gone wrong. And if you are not experiencing any problems in your cluster, a green check mark assures you that everything is fine. The cluster page of React Control lists all of the nodes in the system along with useful information on each node listed. Included are the name of the node, whether or not the node is responding to pings and other communications, the percentage of the ring the node owns, and how much memory is currently being consumed on the node's machine. In the cluster page, you'll see that each node has its own actions panel with a set of controls for node management. With the actions panel, each node can be stopped, marked as down, or removed from the cluster, all at the simple click of a button. From the cluster page, new nodes can be added to the cluster, simply by typing a node name into a field and hitting the Add Node button. And at any time a new node joins the cluster, or when another node leaves the cluster, partition ownership changes. For an example of this, let's examine a four-node cluster. If one node were to leave this cluster, three remaining nodes in the cluster will automatically adjust their percentage of partition ownership from 25% to 33% as the node leaving the cluster hands off its partitions to the remaining three nodes. And as changes occur across the cluster, React Control displays these changes in near real time. The ring page lists out all partitions by index, displaying each partition's name as well as the current status of each of the partition's workers, namely the KV worker, React Pipe, and React Search. Status will change to indicate when node workers are in an active state a fallback state, a handoff state, or disabled. An example of this might be when partition ownership changes, like when a node joins or leaves the cluster. The status of each specific partition will be reflected in near real time on the ring page. And because systems could have a large number of partitions, the ring page provides pagination and filtering options, giving users the ability to navigate quickly to the data they're looking for. In the ring page, users have the option to view all partitions, filter such that they only see the nodes that are in a fallback state, or filter to only see the nodes that are in a handoff state. And all throughout the application, users can obtain additional information by simply hovering over various page elements. We hope you've enjoyed this short overview of React Control. To learn more about Basho Technologies and the React product line, visit www dot basho dot com